Hello, my friends. Welcome back to all of you. Thank you so much for leading me towards 400 subscribers. We are nearly there. I appreciate every single person that comes and smacks that subscribe button. And I feel all of you like a family. I'm here to bring more content, good content, and it takes a lot of effort. Now, what you just seen, a couple of videos uh, compiled in one with the explosion, the explosion of the bridge between uh, Russia and Crimea. It seems that Russians are losing the war, or at least it seems. According to Russian news agency TASS, an explosion occurred in early Saturday morning on one of uh, Putin's uh, projects uh, and Europe's longest bridge, which connects Russia and Crimea. The outlet uh, news said an object believed to be a fuel storage tank caught fire on the Crimean bridge, but the viaduct's uh, navigable arches sustained no damage. An aide to the head of uh, Crimea uh, said to the news outlet, the news outlet let us know. The head of the Crimea uh, region under Russian jurisdiction now is Oleg uh, Kruchkov. Kruchkov wrote in his Telegram channel as well these words. According to preliminary information, a fuel storage tank is on fire. Navigable arches are no damage. It is too early to speak about causes and consequences. Work to extinguish the blazes underway. Crimean Bridge, also known as Kerch Strait Bridge or Kerch Bridge, is a pair of parallel bridges, one road, one rail, spanning the Kerch Strait between the Taman Peninsula of Krasnodar Krai in Russia and the Kerch Peninsula of Crimea in Ukraine. After annexing Crimea at the start of the Russo-Ukrainian War, Russia built a bridge. It is the longest bridge ever constructed in Russia at 19 kilometers, of about 12 miles, and the longest bridge in all of Europe. Besides transportation, Russia's motivation for building the bridge was to legitimize its territorial claims in Crimea. Now let's see what's going to happen after this explosion. Uh, we don't know for sure how much the bridge has been damaged. Has it been severely damaged or... Uh, we don't know. We will find out later on. And again, the question pops up in my mind. The question that uh, I will ask you as well, my friends, please tell me, do you think that the Russia is losing the war? Or uh, this is a part of their strategic moves or uh, what's going to happen from now on? Will it be a nuclear war as well? Uh, uh, somewhere uh, on the verge of happening? I don't know. Anyway, God bless you all. Thank you so much for watching and up to next time. Stay close. See you soon.